Hey guys, I am back again with Bambox for Ho 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 December. Alright, so I'm actually pretty excited about this one because I found out there's going to be some Marvel stuff and some DC, DC stuff in here. Um, who knows, will it be Christmas themed? I have no idea. So let's get this party started. Okay. Mm -hmm. There we go. Ooh. Oh, okay. So that's kind of kind of neat here. Um, so what they start doing with the band box is they start putting uh, print on the inside. So as you can tell, it's marble print. Pretty cool. That should probably be the spoiler book, and it looks like the theme is legends. And they have nice wrapping for you, so you don't spoil spoil yourself. Ooh. Okay, start off with the band pen. Oh my god, I freaking love this band pen already. This is a Game of Thrones Winter is Coming band pen. So, that's pretty cool. I love these band pens because they have such awesome detail, and I really like this pen. So that's really cool. Sweet. I think that's Jon Snow, too. It's like... It's a combination between Jon Snow and um, Winter Soldier. Which is actually kind of funny, because winter is coming. Uh. Alright. I got something in this bag here. Don't know what it is. I guess I should probably untie it. Oop, okay, it doesn't extend out any further. What? Okay, <laughs> that's awesome. So, they gave me, I got in this cool little pouch, two kunai, all right. I love weapons, so this is already starting to be an awesome box. Ooh, they're sharp too. Ooh, ooh. All right, I'm gonna put these back in the. It's nice. It came with a cool pouch too. Nice little pouch so that you can put them in, so you don't cut anybody. All right, so that's awesome. Looks like we have something with certif uh, certificate of authenticity. Ooh, it is a Marvel number one variant edition Star Wars Vader Down comic. So that is pretty cool. No signature or anything, but that's okay. Because I have a certificate of authenticity. So that's pretty nice. And we got another certificate of authenticity. And I don't know, this is actually the one thing I don't know who it is. Red... Is it so Santa? Red Santa? Red Sonia? Something like that? This is another comic book. Uh, issue number zero. What? Okay. But this one is signed. Okay, yeah, so I got a signed copy of this comic book here. Red Sonia, I have really no idea who, who that is. All right, two more prints. Ooh, I'm liking this. Another certificate of authenticity. This is a 72 out of 500 signed print. Looks like it's like a combination between Star Wars and Samurai. I don't know if you can see that very well. I apologize. Maybe maybe this is better. 
because I'm taking away the light. Okay, so that's that's pretty cool. And last but not least, the last print. I thought I thought there was gonna be DC in here, but I guess I guess not. Oh, guess what? I guessed wrong because I did get DC, and I got the. Um, Justice Society of America um, signed print photo from the um, Legends of Tomorrow TV show, the two characters. Um, I, I think it's Star Girl or something like that. Star Spangle Girl. And I forget the, the, the mask dude. Okay, so at least I got something DC, so that's pretty neat. Oh. Look at that. I have at the very bottom, my brother would love this actually, the very bottom to have more print. And it is Ninja Turtles. That's awesome. All right. So yeah, let me go ahead and look at the spoiler book because I definitely like this box. That's freaking awesome. I, I love that art, that artwork. Okay, I love the kunai and I love the pen, so you guys did yourself again, outdid yourself again this time, which is awesome. Alright, let's see what I, else I could have gotten. Alright, for the band pins, hmm, okay, I could have gotten, looks like it's a, a red pen with an octopus with a smiley face, I could have gotten that or the black and white edition. Then there's a Captain America pen and my Winter is Coming pen. I don't know if you can see that very well. Or something like that. Focus maybe? I don't know. All right, and then of course we get the limited edition Vader's Vader Down, number one by Dan, Namek Forces, limited release of 5,000. All right, so it says here, Dynamic Forces is proud to present Vader Down number one, a DF exclusive by artist Oliver Kloipel. When Darth Vader accidentally finds himself facing off against the Rebel fleet on his own, the Rebels will learn the truth, true strength of the dark side of the Force. Limit to only 1,500, sorry, sorry about that, 15,000 released. Look for the black and white cover limited to only 5,000 released, so. Um, actually, did I get the black and white? No, no. Uh, I can't tell. Actually, I think I got the black and white. I mean, you can, you can barely tell because of the color scheme. But yeah, yep, I, I definitely got the black and white variant cover. But um, yeah, okay, so that's cool. Yeah, I, you can't even barely tell that it's a variant cover. Because Darth Vader's black and the stormtroopers are white, so it's kind of hard to see that. All right, start your own legend set. So with Kunai, it says every legend begins with a story and every story involves a person, most often encountering some sort of peril. Whether on their own or part of a team, they're faced with the decision and in that decision, either with acts of bravery or deceit, they became a legend. And what do most legends have in common? They need to a way to battle, attack or defend. Okay, so this kind of Legends of Tomorrow, like uh, the Assassin, White Canary, because it's talking about legend, so I don't know. Maybe I'm going too far with that, but who knows. All right, now with this print, which I'm, I'm in love with this artwork here, because it's awesome. All right, so yeah, what it is, it's a band box exclusive, signed and numbered. Oh, okay, it is signed. I didn't see that. Signed and numbered by artist Brian Reedy. 
It's called the Galactic Samurai Art Print. Okay, so I mean, he got, I guess he kind of, like, storm, uh, stormtrooper-ish. Or, no, not stormtrooper. You know what I'm talking about, the, the, um, I'm just gonna stop myself because I'm, uh, drawing the blank. But anyway, you guys know what I'm talking about, so that's pretty cool. Galactic Samurai. I want to see what I could have gotten. Alright, so it says next month's theme is anniversary, which I'm definitely going to get that one also. Alright. It says here, don't miss the most epic band box yet. We are celebrating our one year anniversary to say thank you to everyone. We are going to bring back some of your favorite items and artists. This month's prints will feature favorite artists Rocky Davis and Chris Umenga. Probably butchered that name. Um, the one of a kind animations will make their appearance in this box. But this time, as actual sales from varying shows, we have some other items going in as well that we're really excited about. It says, oh, I almost forgot. I had a couple of really special studio quality hockey masks made just for this box to be signed. Whoa, that's awesome. I think it is safe to say the item everyone loved the most over the last year was the Ari Lehman signed hockey mask. Is it possible to improve on this item? You'll have to wait and see. Okay. Alright, so Red, Red Sanja. I kept saying Sonia. Red Sanja, number, number zero. <laughs> I had to make sure that was number zero. So, okay. It says, the barbarian legend She Devil with a sword faces a whole different world and challenges in this new adventure run by Amy Chu and drawn by Carlos Gomez. Every cover is hand signed by Written Chu and includes a dynam dynamite COA. C COA. Look for a special silver. Signed edition numbered out of 100 and a gold signed edition number out of 50. In addition, look for randomly inserted signed scent of colors. So I can't remember if I got the silver or the gold sign. Come on, get out of here. Oop. Damn, so I didn't get it. Alright, next is the Stargirl. Yeah, that's what it is. The, the sticker. I'm guessing everyone gets this one. Alright, so it says here... We have to be honest, the Golden Age supergroup known as the JSA, Justice Society of America, appearing on DC's Legend of Tomorrow, was one of the things we were most excited for for this TV season. For those of you not familiar with the JSA, or wondering if it's the same as JLA, which it's not. There are some really great articles that you can find that will say it better than we can. And so you can imagine how excited we were to have actress Sarah Gray, who plays, oh, so it's, okay. Sarah Gray is a star girl. So she signed it. And that excitement leveled up when we heard of a J JSA spinoff rumor. Oh, okay. Cool. I did not hear about that either. So that's a neat spinoff. You can also catch Sarah this March in the upcoming Power Rangers movie as Amanda. Oh, shit. I didn't know she was Amanda. Does not look like her. Whoa. Aw. I wanted that. Okay, so apparently the giveaway, which obviously I didn't get because it's too big for my uh, box, is a sword. Oop. Sword. Yeah. A sword. Lord of the Rings sword. King Gordon. Oh, duh. Aragorn. Aragorn. It's Aragorn's sword. So... 
Uh, let's see. To win, simply take a picture. Oh, ooh, okay. Obviously, this is the giveaway. So I'm going to take a picture of my favorite item and post it to one of the social sites below using Bandbox so we can find you. Winner announced January 8th. I would definitely undo it because that's a cool ass sword. All right, so that is it. Merry Christmas to me and other people that bought Bandbox because it's pretty cool. Um, all right, so that is my Bandbox unboxing re slash review. And I'm definitely in love with this box. I'm actually kind of happy I got the black and white variant cover for um, the, uh, the Darth Vader comic. All right, guys. All right. Stick around for, a, for more coming your way towards the end of this lovely year. Um, probably won't get a video out by Christmas. So um, you'll probably see one after. Anyway. Stick around, guys. Thanks for watching. Have a good one. Merry Christmas. Happy Holidays. Happy New Year. Merry Kwanzaa. Happy, uh, happy Holidays. So, all right. Have a good one, guys.